up guys it's charles vlogs and today today's i'm back again with another video and it's scripture sunday every sunday i read a scripture for you guys and i break it down so today's scripture is going to be coming from psalms 26 and 5 now this this uh verse is coming from a psalm psalms 23 and i memorized it by heart and i encourage you guys to memorize it too uh, it's important for you to uh at least memorize this or something like the lord's prayer and it's just really good to memorize it or have it by heart so psalms 26 and 5 the preparest a table before me in the presence of my enemies. Thou knowest my head with oil, my cup runneth over. All right, I'm gonna read that one more time. Thou preparest a table before me in the of the of my no sorry. Thou preparest a table before me in the presence of my enemies. Thou knowest my head with oil, my cup runneth over. So now it's time for me to break it down. So my my main what I really want to focus on today, I want to focus on my cup runneth over. But I'm gonna explain what the first two uh, what what does it mean. So the first one. The prepares a table before me, the, the presence of my enemies. Maybe maybe wondering why does um why does God prepare a table before me, my my enemies? Well, the reason why is because He knows that you have peace in your heart. When you have peace in your heart, and you have the um uh when you have the righteousness of God in you, um uh, you know that you can overcome your enemies and that you can have dinner with them, so called. And this the second one. Uh, that anoints my head with uh, that that anoints my head with oil. Now, what do you what do you uh, you may be asking? What does that mean? Well, uh, basically, when you put like oil on your head on the head, um, like my pastor at my church, he what he does sometimes, um, occasionally he does like he'll ask like kids or even grownups to come to the altar and like he'll put like a get oil put on his hand and put a cross over it well that's kind of stands for protection he does a prayer and stuff like that so it's kind of like protection that's what that means and so what i really want to focus on today is my cup runneth over so when you have faith in god he'll bless you you know when you go through if you go through something when you have faith in god he will bless you and this the, the beginning of psalms 23 it says the lord is my shepherd i shall not want and that's kind of leading up to my cup runneth over and so what i'm saying you is today when if you put when god is your shepherd he provides you know think about a shepherd and a sheep uh and sheep a shepherd provides for his sheep and there's a, a saying that god leaves the 99 he does that he'll leave all the 99 sheep to go after that one god is an amazing shepherd guys i'm telling you that right now and what you'll notice is in the future what you notice is when you keep walking with god he'll not only provide for you but he'll prosper you what does that mean i'm talking about he'll provide for you provide for you provide for you uh he'll give it to you but he'll prosper you he'll uh, my cup runneth over so i have it a little to make it more uh so you can visualize it let, let me let me show you an example come on all right you guys so what i have here i have a water bottle and i have a cup you remember i told you that god not only provides but he prospers you so i'm going to show you an example so say for but if you, if you don't have god as your shepherd if you get your uh if you expect the world to provide for you this is what the world will do see you may go to the world the world only fills the cup about this much right it only goes like this. But when God is your shepherd, look, look, look what God does. Look what God does. He'll do this. Remember, your cup runneth over. It overflows with abundance. See that? It overflows. And sooner or later, you're going to need a bigger cup to put, put your abundance in. So yeah, guys, remember, God not only provides, but he prospers you. So that's it for today's video. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, give this video a like. If you're new to the channel, I encourage you to subscribe to the notifications and comment when you're done so I can give you a shout out. Thank you guys for 200 subscribers. It's been 100. Stay positive, stay happy, and remember, never give up. I'll see y'all next time. Peace.